Hey, hello my dear YouTube friends. How are you doing today? Sorry, you can hear the ice truck in the background. It's... <laughs> they come around every every other week, I think. Every other Friday. And they drive around here. Anyway, today's Friday, so we have an unboxing for you. But before we look into it, welcome if you're new. I, I'm really happy you're here. And I hope you consider subscribing. There is an subscribe button right down there next to it you find a bell if you ding that and choose all you'll be notified whenever i put up new put up a new video and i do that roughly three times a week and i have a live on sundays so yeah you're more than welcome to drop by and you know hear about my life and if you're back hi friends i'm really really happy you're here too and yeah don't forget to give my video a thumbs up before you head out and leave me a comment down below so you know tell me what you think about this unboxing because this unboxing is very very special because this canvas this kit it's not mine okay this isn't mine but I was allowed to unbox this for you this if you are a regular in my lives on sundays you would know her name on youtube is devi divi nina her name is nina and she is a recently new diamond painter i i think me and all the others got her into diamond painting and um, she have wanted to try a diamond art club for quite a while and you know found a few that she would like and we talked about which one she wanted the most and which one would make the most sense you know for the money and this is the one she chose frozen by chris otega it is a square drill diamond painting and it is a 51 by 76 centimeters or a 30 20 by 30 uh, inch so yeah and um, let's, you can see it is a square because it has the square and it has all the blue up here. Here on the side, you have a QR code that gives you a 10% off coupon. And on the back, you have how to diamond paint and what you will find in your kit. And on this, you have nothing. <laughs> so yeah, let's, let's get into it. I'm quite excited because I... I want to know how it feels to unbox a diamond painting that isn't my choice. I mean, this is beautiful. I've been looking at the picture all afternoon since I got it. I sent Nina a, a little video because apparently Messenger won't let you send photos today. Yay them or something. So I sent Nina a little video when I received the, the box. So here you have the little sticker that you always find in your kit. It has the name and the artist, Chris Ortega, and again the size and this, the, um, and it's a square diamond drill. And these stickers, some put them on the box, you know, so they can see which kit it is. Other make them into minders, they put them in, you know, lock books stick them on the crafting table so many opportunities so yeah put that one over here so it won't fly away and this was my surprise because if i remember correctly this kit is a bit older so i was surprised to find one of these new tool kits but yeah here in the back you have whatever you find in it and remember these these little bags they are reusable and recyclable I know you have this little rip thing up here, but you don't need to. You can just open it. So let's take a look. Ooh, look at that. Wow. So first up, let's take a look at your diamond pen and your squishy or grippy, whatever you want to call it. And this is a black one with silver glitter in it. I love that color. I actually think it goes well with the kit. And then we have this little bag of baggies. You can uh, kit up into those 
if you want to, or you can, you know, store your leftover drills in them. And they're really good. Then, because this is a square kit, you get these, sorry, these branded tweezers. They are quite pointy, so please keep this little hat on. I have stabbed myself and I can't recommend it. Then we have this little heart-shaped container with two pieces of red wax in it. Don't forget, you know, to remove this plastic layer on either side of them because otherwise you won't be able to put in the wax in your, um, in your pen. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm a little flustered today. And then to go with your diamond painting pen, you have these little multi-placers. These are the good thin ones. You have a four placer and a seven placer. And if you don't know how to use them, you put them in the other end of your diamond painting pen. You can use putty or you can use the red wax in it. So yeah, whatever you like to do. Oops, sorry. And then, we have this little black ticks, whatever you want to call them in the air today, and they're driving me bungers. Here you have your diamond painting boat, your tray, whatever you want to call it. And this is the good one. It's the white one. And this little thing isn't a mistake. It is a stopper, so that when you shake your drills quite lightly, carefully, you know, they won't run out. Yeah, I really like these little trays. And then the new thing in these new toolkits is you have this washi tape. This is beautiful. It has these little white flowers and it's blue. Again, it matches the kit. Huh. And this is your cover minder. You have two magnets on the back. And you put one of them under your, under your canvas, peel back the plastic, and put this on top of it, if you use these for that. I mean, I use release paper, so these usually just, you know, sit on my canvas and look pretty. This one is a little macaroon, macaron. I had recently heard the difference, and I forgot it again. Apparently, it is either a macaroon or macaron, depending on... If it's from France or the other one around. I can't remember, but it was quite interesting. So yeah, let's don't run away. Let's get this over here so that we can take a look at what we're here for. This is the the canvas, it's the drills, it's the pamphlet and it's the sticker sheet and it is in this dust bag this branded dust bag it says diamond night club do what makes you sparkle and let's see nina i'm so sorry if i rip it again apparently it is a thing of mine yeah see i ripped it sorry nina apparently i can't open these bags without ripping them i don't know what i'm doing wrong I really don't. Put this plastic bag in here, otherwise it will fly away. It is so beautiful today. We have had rain the past, I don't know, week or so, well not a week, but for many days. So I was a little, you know, do I have to make this inside? But today is beautiful. I love it. We have a little wind and a slight overcast, but I love it. Okay, sorry, back to the kit. Back to the thing we're here for. So, here you have the pamphlet with a thank you note from the founder and owner, Angie. In here you have what's included in your kit in English, Spanish, and French. Over here you have some tips and tricks written down. And down here you have another discount um, code and the back, you have some QR codes for the iPhone app and the Android app. And um, the first time you purchase through the app, you get a 20% off. 
despite you having bought off the website. So that is a really good deal. In here, you have a QR code to a step-by-step -step video made by Diamond Art Club. Down here, sorry, <laughs> down here you have the QR code for for the VIP Facebook group. You can join this group once you have purchased your first diamond painting. And it is really a lot of fun. We have votes, we show each other pictures, and yeah. When you have made your first purchase, please consider joining. It is a lot of fun. And again over here so it don't fly away. Ooh, let's take this one first. Here you have a sticker sheet. It has the name, the artist, and a, I keep bumping you, so sorry, and a place to write your start and end date. You have the diamond shaped square, you have the size, and over here you have a bunch of already, you know, single stickers. They're already cut, so it's easy for them. It's easy to put them on your baggies or on your containers that you kit up into. You have 46 colors and up here if your number is lower than 141 it is an AB drill um, and in this kit we have two 126 and 141 and if you're wondering you know what these numbers are they are called DMC and it's the same system that is used to to floss if you cross stitch and almost every diamond painting company out there is using this DMC coloring system so yeah see those little black thingies they're everywhere today and it's driving me crazy okay so here we have the drills on it you can see there is this little label that says frozen this is very handy if you store your drills and your canvas separate. Look at the color scheme. I showed David the, um, the box and the picture and he was like, yeah, this isn't something that you will normally buy, but it is rather beautiful. It's like, yeah, it is very, very beautiful, but not something that I would buy. But I can't wait to see the canvas, how I, you know, feel about it and it is you know it's a lot of gray and blues but there are these beautiful reds and pinks oh look at that oh sorry we will look at this look at this in the end first let's take a look at the canvas we will roll this backwards first so that it will lay down a little flatter if you would just leave it on the table, it would flatten itself out because these canvases have a flat, self-flattening um, thing to them. <laughs> but, you know, to make this video a little easier, I will roll it. If you have a diamond painting that has paper on it, that means it will be a double-sided adhesive and you can never do this. Never. You will ruin it. You will create bubbles and rivers and everything. But because this is a port glue canvas, you can do this. And I also want to tell you, the backing of these diamond paintings, there's a little fluff on it. But, you know, it isn't, it doesn't ruin everything. I just want to move it. The bagging on these diamond paintings, it's so soft. It is so, so, so soft. I mean, I think this is, this isn't the newest version of it because those are like little pillows, but they, they really are soft. And as you can see, the edges, they are scalloped and poked. That means you won't have any issues with fraying. And here you can see the little pasting area, the little thumbnail. Next to it, you will see the name and the size and down here you have this little C copyright that means that Diamond Art Club has asked Chris Ortega for his permission to make this diamond painting and they are compensating him fairly fairly for the use of it here in the middle you have another coupon code for 10% off and you have um, 
where you can find him on Facebook and Instagram. And you could, if you want to show it on Instagram or Facebook, I think, you can use the hashtag Diamond Art Club. Over here, you have some information about the lifetime warranty and free missing diamond protection. That means if you're missing drills when you're doing your diamond painting, you can just contact them if you are the purchaser of the canvas. If you got it from a dish das or a gift, you don't you can't contact them unless you the one you purchased this, purchased it from or the the gift the, the giver will contact Diamond Art Club for you. Anyway, let's get into it. Ooh. Oh, I like her. She's feisty, isn't she? Look at that sword. Ooh. I mean, she's actually very beautiful. She really is. Again, this isn't something that I would do myself, but it is really beautiful. Look at, look at the pink and the blood and her, her tap and that. I don't know if it's is it a um, a shawl a shawl around her. I don't know, but it's beautiful. And that dark hair and her red mouth. Wow, and she's sitting by a, three, a tree, can you see that? And then all the, I think it's the, the sky and then ice or rock. She is beautiful. She really is beautiful. I mean, look at those, look at those legs. They are really perfection. I really, really like it. Yeah, I think this is a wrap top or something. I just got looking at it because it's also down here. Yeah, she's beautiful. What do you think? So, let's take a look at the canvas. We did all, we did look down here, but if you can see, you have a, a legend on either side of the canvas. Here on top, it says, do what makes you sparkle, diamond art club. And let's see. Let's check the the sticky. Ooh, very sticky. And um, I hope you can see how clear this canvas is. I will take a picture and put it in if it isn't very clear. But it is clear as day to me. So yeah, it is pretty, pretty, pretty. I mean, I love these canvases, but. Even from up here, looking down at it, I can see every symbol. And my eyesight isn't always the best. <laughs> Just to be honest with you, I do need to go get them checked out. So, we looked at her. We found out that she's beautiful and that we love the colors. Now, let, let's take a look at these, okay? I'm gonna turn her around. so that the camera won't focus on her instead of these beautiful, amazing drills. I wonder if this is the 13 faceted ones, or uh, if it's a mix of both. These little black things, I don't know if you can see them, but they're crawling all over, and it makes everything itch. Oh yeah, anyway, Enough about those. <laughs> Just driving me crazy. <laughs> okay, so red. We have two bags of 762. We have 413, 3799. We have two bags of 415. We have 317. We have two bags of 3371 and two bags of 318. Ooh, oh, look at this. We have 
two big bags of the AB141. If you don't know what an AB is, AB stands for Aurora Borealis, which is the northern light. And I don't know if you can see all that shimmer and shine here. That is the iridescent layer on top of these drills. And that is what they're named after. I mean, you can see all the colors. You can see blue, pink, yellow, all the colors. Oops, sorry, I bumped you. I mean, this is basically what I do every time, isn't it? Can you see how they're shining? They're so beautiful. And look at those flat backs. I love these drills. So, two big bags of 141. This is the favorite um, AP from Diamond Art Club. That is at least what I've heard from other people. Okay. Then we have 322. Two, two bags of 414. We have 334. 758. I love this one. Then we have... 37.55 and 7.75. We have 9.48, 3, <laughs> Oh, this is a small bag of 3.10. That is actually a really, really small amount. Oh, lucky you, Nina. <laughs> 754 and I actually do like 310 <laughs> especially the newer ones we have 3325 779 we have 3778 and 356 I like this color it's kind of earthy red earthy I like it then we have 803, beautiful blue. We have 3860. Then we have 938 and 838. Look at those. They're almost identical. It will make an amazing shading. Then we have 3861. Would you please? Thank you. <laughs> 3830. We have 3024, 823, 648, and here we have our second AB. It is 126. This beautiful lilac, purple. Can you see again the coating on here? I actually like this this purple one. I really like it. And then we have oh a beautiful red. 355 and 210. This is one of my favorite purples actually. And it has a little straggler. Don't you know how to to keep your distance, man? <laughs> yeah, but I really love this, this color. And the last little strand of drills. We have 3777. We have 963. Ooh, look at this pink. 9.57. I like this one. Ooh, and this one. 37.33. Again, look at it. This will make amazing shading. And again, one of my favorite purples. 209. 37, 37.31. 9.75. 8.15. It's kind of like a red wine red. Maybe a Bordeaux. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Ooh. 3350. A pinkish red. See, I'm drawn to all these girly colors. I can't help it. 814. 3023. And the last one is a beautiful red. 321. Okay. I will... Put the drills away so bear with me a second and then we will look at the canvas again and I will try to see if I can find some of the ABs okay see you in a second we're back again so Nina I really hope you don't hate my packing job I did my best <laughs> yeah 
So the AB, we have the purple one, which is basically up here. It's the number one. And you find that in this, the lighter purple. And this, that is basically where you find it, in this purple. And then number two, remember we had that two big bags of white AB. I mean, you basically have it all over. Everywhere you find this pure white, I mean, it's in the sword, it's in the rocks, it is in this rock, it's in her shawl, whatever it is. It is up here in the sky and in the, the snow and the, in the three, tree everywhere. I mean, it's, is it in her eyes? No, no. I mean, she is, she is beautiful and she will sparkle with all those ABs. I mean, all those white ABs all over the place. There isn't really a lot over here. You have just a few, but I mean, this all the way up there, that'll spark, that will sparkle a lot. So yeah, Nina, I hope you really, really like this canvas because I actually really, really like it. Despite it not being something that I would buy for myself, it is beautiful. So yeah, I got permission from Nina to unbox this. Of course I did. I just wanted to mention that. Um, so yeah, I hope you like this. And I hope you will write some comments to Nina down below how you like her new canvas, her new kit. And give her some encouragement because this will be her first Diamond Art Club kit. So let her know that it is okay and that making the square ones will be a lot of fun. So yeah, please give her some encouragement and some sweet words on the way. And I will see you in my next video, okay? So forget to give me those thumbs up. Give some comments down below for Nina. And if you aren't already subscribed, push that button over there. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, everybody. Love you.